Hi right, guys, Matt Luxon here from Blast Fitness Camps. Um, tonight I'm here with James and Kate and uh, they've just stayed behind after a pretty wicked session. Um, and I've just asked them if they would just stay behind and just let, let, let you guys know a little bit about what they've been getting up to um, on their second month of their camp. Um, thanks for staying behind guys. Um, Kate, first of all for you, like, what, what, was it, what was it that you liked most about this format? Because I know you were really looking forward to getting involved um, back in January. Um, so what was, it, what was it that you liked about this? Um, it's just really good because you know that you know three times a week you're going to be doing 40 minutes of really good exercise and you know it, usually when you get home you're tired and you think oh I can't be bothered to go out to the gym now but with this you know you're going to be there with a group of people and you're going to work really hard and then when you come back you know you, you yeah. feel great yeah, yeah. Now, how, how do you feel about um, the group of people like the way it is obviously with people sort of starting all at the same time like having that same group of people, is that something you like as well? Or yeah. Obviously you get to know the people that are on the camp as well, don't you? So. It is really good working as a group and you can just push yourself as much as you want. You can see everyone else is pushing themselves as well. Yeah. But it's nice to have it as a group. You know, it's a big that group of people. motivation aspect, haven't you, that you wouldn't get if you just go to the gym. You've got, because everyone is working for their own goals. But because they're, they're trying, aiming to get something, they're pushing you along as well. Yeah, so it's even, like, even it's not necessarily like um, comp direct competition between people, but if you see that person's not stopping, then you're probably not going to stop yourself. You'll, you'll keep yeah. going uh, in that way. That's good. So with the, uh, with the nutrition, then, how have you, how have you found that? Because obviously that's a big part of it. Um, how have you found it, James? Um, yeah, it's really good. I mean, uh, Kate does most of the cooking. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Shopping, yeah. washing Delegate, up. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, no, they're really good meals. Uh, you can stick to it. Uh, it's it's not like um, uh, a difficult plan to keep to, no. and they're good tasting meals. Um, yeah, so it's sort of fits in with your life really rather. Yeah, than sort quite of easy. It's not a struggle to actually keep to it. Yeah. You know, it, it's mm -hmm. easy. Yeah. Makes sense. And yeah. it's been really nice having the um, like the oat and the rice milk and stuff. We've yeah. never had that before, but now. Just we have that and um, that is really good. Good, good. Yeah. yeah, excellent. That's been really good. What would you um, what would you say to anyone like? Because I mean, James, you've played rugby before, haven't you? So they, you know, like you're used to the sort of intensive kind of intervals like that. What would you say to someone, you know, who was worried that perhaps it was going to be a bit too intense or wasn't going to be intense enough? Because obviously, you know, you haven't done that yeah. before. Yeah. Um, I mean, like we say, you, you set your own goals. So if you're used to uh, very intense workouts, then you are going to get that intensity still because you're going to be pushing yourself. But if you haven't worked out for a while, if you're worried about the intensity, then you ease yourself into it and you you can gradually build yourself up like so many people have in the um, in the group. Yeah, it's yeah. been some, uh, some, some uh, you can definitely see, can't you? Know, you can definitely see, I mean, even with yourselves, mm. like like relatively fit before you even came onto this, you can definitely see like, how you've been improving. I mean, like, yeah. like body strength, core strength. Um, like leg endurance and stuff like that, you can definitely see it. Yeah, you, you've got that thing, you, you can't chicken out of the exercise now. You're like, you can go to the gym and you can you can think you work out hard for 40 minutes, but you do always allow that extra bit of rest time on, on this camp. You, yeah. don't, you don't get that, like, you're forced to continue one <laughs> exercise after the other. So yeah, Brutal. yeah it works well. <laughs> yeah, good stuff. Excellent it's stuff. Really good. Um, yeah, so we're, we're in week three now, aren't we, of the, the second camp, yeah. Yeah, for you guys, anyway. And, um, yeah, so I mean, really, like, just looking, looking forward now. We've introduced the ropes, something for the uh, first time the other day. Yeah. Yeah. Ropes are good. good. Yeah, yeah. 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 Really good. Great, like, upper body exercise, like, for you, James, I know you've done a bit of paddling. Yeah, that's going to help me with the paddling, the engine. Um, yeah, certainly feel it after the ropes. Yeah, good yeah, times. Good. Yeah, that's brilliant. Cool. I think that's yeah. that about tells everyone what they need to know. I mean, that's that's James and Kate so far on the on the fitness camp, um, telling you basically how, how easy the nutrition was to get to into everyday life. Yeah. Uh, you know, if you're worried about being the you know the most unfit or the mo or if it's not going to be hard enough, then I don't think you really need to worry about that. Um, and you know, basically. Take action, really, like you guys did. Yeah, do yeah. something about it. Get involved with me. All right. <laughs> Thanks, guys. That's okay. Cheers. <laughs>